There are a number of different ways to collect student-created work from a classroom set of iPads. And if you're already using Edmodo with your students, this solution may work for you. This will allow students to turn in any content that can be saved to the device's camera roll, like images and video, not pages, documents, PDF files, or keynote presentations. I'm going to illustrate the process of turning in iPad-created content from both the teacher and the student point of view. First, as a teacher, I want to log in and create an assignment. We'll call it our exciting iPad project. I'll give it a description, I'll set the due date, and I'll send it out to my students. As you can see, I have quite a few famous students in my group, and we're going to log in as one of them to turn in a few of his iPad creations. So our student, George, logs in to the Edmodo app on his iPad, and he sees he has an assignment waiting on him. So let's say that George made a disaster movie poster about landslides using the Foster app. He opens the Foster app and he saves his work to the camera roll, which is also known as the photo library. He then returns to the Edmodo app and chooses the add to library button at the top of the screen. The icon looks like a camera. He selects the album option and then chooses camera roll and clicks on the item he wants to upload. In this case, it's his disaster movie poster. Once the upload is complete, George can look in his library, also called his backpack, and see his movie poster. Once an item is in his library, George has lots of options. He can view it at home or school, share it with his classmates, or keep it private as part of his own digital portfolio. But for this video, George is going to turn in his work as an assignment. He finds the exciting iPad project assignment created by his teacher and chooses the turn in option. He can add a description and use the library button to find content in his library to turn in, and then he submits his work to his teacher. When his teacher logs into Edmodo, he'll be notified that George has turned in his iPad project. The teacher can then view George's work, give feedback, and even give the project a grade. As I mentioned before, this option also works for video assignments. So let's say George created a movie trailer using the iMovie app on his iPad. When he's done, he saves his video to the camera roll and the app will notify him when his video has finished exporting. He then opens up the Edmodo app just like before and he adds the video to his library where it can be shared with his classmates or turned in as an assignment. From the teacher's perspective, the only real difference is that the video file must first be downloaded before it can be played. The teacher can still view the assignment, grade it, and give feedback. If you're already using Edmodo, then this is a quick and easy option for collecting student-created images and video from your iPads. Using the library can be a great way for kids to manage their own content and have access to their work at any time.